good with y'all man this is your boy tick aka game fanatic the michael jordan the gaming back with another battlefield 3 gameplay and man i don't know if y'all know by now man but this game is wonderful i'm loving it the gameplay the graphics i mean the graphics are just amazing dog oh my god like i'm i'm, I'm stunned dude like i really am but you only get this quality on the pc <laughs> I mean, it looks good on the consoles, man, but, man, it just looks ridiculous on the PC. Look at this. Here's my failed attempt at trying to shoot this dude down. <laughs> I was relentless, man. I was like, man, I'm going to try to get him, dog. That would be nice for the video, but I, I still haven't gotten the... I still haven't learned the mechanics of this game yet. I, I don't know how fast those missiles shoot and everything yet, so I had to leave it alone. But um, this gameplay is a rush gameplay. I decided... To I decided to record Rush this time. Normally I play Team Deathmatch, but I got a little bored of that, and I was like, let me try to play Rush. And mind you, this game was about 18 minutes long. I had to do a lot of editing just to shorten it for y'all. Oh, shoot. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I always get shot from somebody I don't see, but that's not a problem. I actually like that, man. That's real. So, you know, that's nothing to me. That's, that's okay. But anyway, man, um... Yeah, I don't really have much to talk about today. Nothing really at all. I just decided to throw a video up and everything. Look at that. I'm amazed by the graphics. That's why I'm looking up in the air. I was just amazed. <laughs> I was like, wow, this is crazy looking, dude. But, um, yeah, there's nothing really much to talk about. Um, I started school today. Uh, yeah, your boy Tick is back in school. I took a semester off in the, um, for fall. Only because I had bills and things I had to take care of and stuff like that and I needed to work so I took a semester off. But your boy Tick is back in there. You know I had to go back because I had to get my education. But anyway, it, it was cool, you know. Only thing I had a problem with is uh, financial aid didn't give me all the money for my books. Oh, wait a minute. I just saw somebody. Hold on. Hold on. Where he go? Oh, there he is. Caught him slipping. <laughs> And I think it was somebody up top of the hills right there too, but I was—I saw the tank then. I was like, the tank will take care of him. So I go over here to plant the bomb. You know, your boy Tick does play the objective. While a lot of the bombs planted, now it's time to get out of here before I get shot in the back. <laughs> but yeah, the final shade, hey, man, they didn't give me enough for my books. So uh, I'm a little upset about that. I got to go find out a way to get some more money. So I'm going to go talk to the financial aid director or whatever. Because she usually holds money for students that need it, so... I'm going to go hit her up just for a book. That's all. Anyway, you see this dude on top of the hill. Take him out easy. <laughs> actually, that's not as easy as it looks, man. This game actually has bullet drop. So, you know, the further away the person is, the bullets are dropping. You have to compensate for that. When I say compensate, I don't mean lag compensate like some game has that screwed the whole shit up. Modern Warfare 3. <laughs> anyway... I don't really have much to talk about, like I said. Um, so we're just going to freestyle this one. Whatever comes up in my mind, we're going to talk about it. <laughs> Sorry, I had to burp. <laughs> but anyway, what's going on here? Where am I going? Because I don't remember this gameplay, man. This shit was long. I only remember certain parts. <laughs> but uh, like I said, man, um, this shit is this shit is wonderful. Hold up. Got, got me a target. Uh, I'm failing. I'm failing a little bit. He finally died. I don't know how he died so late. <laughs> well, I guess he bled out. I'm not sure. But, um, yeah. Sorry about that. I had to leave the channel in Ventrilo. If you heard that doo-doo noise, that was that. Because I didn't want nobody talking inside the video. You feel me? But, um, yeah. Oh, and I just thought about something. Because I was just talking about how this game is better on the PC. Um, I was getting a lot of comments on my videos, you know, the APB video and my last Battlefield video. People were saying that, you know, games are nice, 
but I'm not a PC person. Like, what does that mean? Uh, like, really? Like, I just want, I want to know. Just leave it in the comments what's that mean because I wasn't always a PC person, you feel me? I mean, like, I mean, you have to learn. I mean, you have to get used to it. And what it seems to me is people just don't want to, either they don't really like PC because, uh, I don't know, maybe this it's just a console fan fanboy or something or they don't want to take the time to learn how to use a mouse and keyboard it's not hard like I mean I came from playing consoles before I got on the PC I think the first time my family got a computer was back in 95 and we had a Windows 95 computer well it wasn't 95 it was 96 hold up uh, uh, I thought he was about to kill me uh, God is the whole time I didn't even see dude right there on the right <laughs> he came up and took my little stupid ass out. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I mean, I started off on consoles, Nintendo, Sega Genesis, Super Nintendo. I mean, I didn't own a Super Nintendo, but my homeboys did. And I would play it occasionally. But, uh, you know, we got the computer in 96. My sister brought, she bought some games on it. She bought Road Warriors. It's something else with that name. It's like two names to it. Um, it was a game about some guy in a prison. He broke out of some shit and he got in a taxi cab with all these weapons on it. And it's basically, it was like, the graphics were like Doom. You go around killing people, uh, killing other cars, stuff like that. It was pretty fun. I used to love playing it. Then she got a game that was a demo named Strife. And that game was like Doom. It was a first person shooter though. And um, it had RPG elements mixed into it. So that game was pretty cool. I remember playing that all the time too. But I didn't really become a hardcore computer gamer until like, 2003 <clears throat> and mind you all between them, I've been playing consoles so you know I was watching uh, G4 Arena I don't know if you guys remember that show it used to come on G4 it basically was like a group of guys that were playing like games against each other competing maybe like first person shooters and stuff like that and they were playing Call of Duty and I saw that and I was like man that game looks serious and uh hold up phone check nigga Urgh. Uh, straight jacking him for his dog chain, man. Now that's real. That's a real game. I mean, that's really like taking somebody's dog chain. Not like that stupid, you know, hashed up game mode that Modern Warfare 3 came up with. But you know what I mean. But anyway, so I saw them playing Call of Duty, and I was like, man, that game looks tight. Though. I need to get that. So I saw it was only for the PC. So I called my brother up. We went out and we copped it on the PC. I had like a newer PC, by the way. It was like a a gateway from like 2001 or something got that mind you I didn't know anything about PC so I didn't know about like graphics cards and none of that nonsense so I went and got it anyway hooked it up hold on watch this watch this I was mad I should have missed that but I still sat him down lay it down <laughs> and then I tried to take this dude dog chain but his homeboy is right there and he saved his dumb ass life I haven't know he was there yo but it's all good Anyway, got got Call of Duty, man, and my graphics card was lame and all that stuff. It was moving slow as shit, but it was still playable. I could still play it. But I had to get used to the controls because I wasn't used to the keyboard. And it was a lot different from the games that I had on my Windows 95, like the controls. It was a lot, it was a lot complicated, a lot more complicated. So I had to get used to it, and it only took me about an hour. So you know, people saying that they can't play these PC games. Watch this. How did I miss that? How did I miss that, dog? Oh my god, that was a two piece, but it's all good, man. I ain't mad about it. <laughs> but these guys saying that they, they can't play on the PC is, and just because they can't get used to the mouse and keyboard is crazy. And then, you know, I know a couple of guys that actually went and bought a controller because they couldn't use the mouse and keyboard. Like, that's crazy to me. I got used to it at a young age, and you tell me like a 20 something year old person can't get used to it? Come on now. That's crazy. But that's like me playing on the consoles for the first time when I got my Xbox 360 and I was like, and I should have been like, okay, well, I need to get a keyboard and a mouse because I can't use these controllers. Because I was having a problem playing with it, but I eventually just got used to it, man. I had to man up. Lay it down and watch this, watch this. Flashlights! Ugh! Took his little ugly ass down, but this homeboys came in right after it and destroyed me, though. <laughs> but, yeah, I wanted to get a mouse and keyboard, but I decided not to. I just sat there and played with a controller until I got used to it. And as you can see from my Modern Warfare and Black Ops videos, man, you know, I got pretty good at it. <laughs> but, uh, 
Anyway, man, this video is coming to an end. If you like the commentary, you know what to do. Hit that thumbs up. Also, man, uh, if you want to hear some more good content or see some more good content, please subscribe. I'd love to have you. And I want to say hi to all my new subs also, man. But it's your boy Tick. And I'm gone. Bye.